Rain is good. Yeah, so they're all happy down there. Yeah. Well, I didn't give them any more because they yeah. 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 they yeah. the the it on the ground. ground. So I was like, you can eat off the ground, right? Is that that's okay. absolutely correct? Right. <laughs> so they walk all over. That's what I thought. Yeah. Like a foot of it. Like a foot of alpha cubes. Look at that in this box. I know. Exciting. <laughs> yeah, I have to do some, uh, we'll get those down to the bar tomorrow. Oh, I have some there. Okay. Uh, when you were feeding them, they were crazy. Did someone write it down? Is that how they yes. always are? Or? Right here. Mm -hmm. So we'll do it all day again tomorrow. Yep. Morning seems to work, but this afternoon was a little bit better for them, so I'm just going to. I think you should be The pond. Works anywhere else you put them, they stand there. I swear to God, I see Steve saw it. We put them on Hangman Hill. This. <laughs> we let them loose down below. They were just like, <laughs> like just stand around. We put them in the pond. You're like a jackrabbit. I like the one of them. Yeah, I love them in the pond. Eh? Yeah, I don't know. Whatever. And she likes that hill up behind. Whatever the works. Yeah, right. I don't know. What it was at this moment in time. Actually, like when uh, she was tying with Jasper, that was a good place for her. She went there too. Yeah. Yeah. There you go. That works. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. All right. <laughs> I like your shirt. Blessed are the peacemakers, for they should be called the sons of God. Everybody else is a son of a bitch. <laughs> what it says in the fine print. Isn't? In the fine print, yes. How are the dolphins? It'll drop down, right? It's been dropping down like 15 degrees. Yeah. Right. Are you done out there? Okay, if somebody can let me know if they hear me because it's been a while and I'm not getting my usual response saying that the sound is on. So, yeah, I saw it there and I was like, I don't feel like this. Should. I shut the door, and I was like, I'm just gonna right inside, right the, inside door. the door. Yeah, it was heavy. I had to sort out all the chain link couplers. Chain link's beautiful, it is. But they sent us really cheap, I mean, those double binder things that you know, the hold on, they really cheap. You bet three. We don't bend the, the kind I usually have. Okay, thank you, Diane. I guess everybody can hear me. We got a good question to start off with. Would you tell us again about the rope and the ring leash? How long is it? Would a slip knot work instead of the ring? No. The reason we use the ring is because, remember, if you heard any of the trainers talk about the slip chain um, that we train the dogs on, it has to be able to loosen freely. It's the same thing. I use the ring and rope when I transport a dog from the kennel to the vehicle, from kennel to kennel, to kennel to the barn, wherever I'm going, just to transfer them around. When I'm training them, I use the slip chain, but it's the same thing as the slip chain. When you loose or release that slip chain, it should automatically go free and open up to the full extent. It should drop right down so the ring meets the ring. On the ropes that I use to transfer a dog, it has to be the same thing. The rope has to slip freely so that it's not tight on the dog's neck all the time. So when you let loose, it should again slip right back down. If you use a slip knot, you're using rope against rope. It's not going to freely open up all the way, and that's going to cause a problem. The whole surrounding of the way these dogs are trained is snap and release. When you make a correction, you give a little tug and release it immediately so that they know that a correction is being made. And that's how they're all trained. That's why we try to get people to understand that the slip chains are the way that they should be dealt with all the time. Putting a regular collar on or any other kind of mechanism isn't going to be work because they're not trained that way. It's a good question. Yeah. 
And you'll notice both Megan and I, and I'm sure Olivia the same way, we only use two fingers when we're holding on to that leash. As soon as you feel the pressure of walking too fast on those two fingers, you snap, release, with the command of wait. And that gets them to back off. Uh, we're not holding on for dear life. We're not all the way full length. It's just quick, quick snap release to let them know the correction's being made. Uh, and it's moving right along. Hopefully, yes. Maybe some of the lights on the arm, too. All the dogs are moving right along on schedule. We got the cheering squad over there, right? We got the cheering squad. <laughs> don't wish for something you don't want. <laughs> Let sleeping dogs lie. That's right. You know, that's one of the hardest the hardest things I have with Tanner. Mariah and Charlie will be laying down just as peaceful and quiet as can be, and he just, for some reason, has to come right in, wake them up, and get them all riled up again. Sounds like Tanner. And he'll be at 5.30 in the morning. He just decides to come in and visit the dogs. And I always tell him, if the dog's being quiet, leave it alone. <laughs> Because Mariah and Charlie, they'll get up any time of the night and go play. I mean, they, they like to play with each other. But not when I'm sleeping. <laughs> he is terrible at that. supposed to get rain today, but I don't think I, we had more than a few sprinkles all day. Didn't have anything. Tomorrow. Great. I think I've had enough rain for this spring already. Today is, yes. She often shows up by Katana and some watermelons. My grandfather gets actually have Okay, we get this question a lot about dogs jumping. First of all, if you don't squash a jumping dog, you are going to be in deep trouble. Dogs should not jump. Dogs should not take their foot and paw at you. And as soon as that happens, you have to be instantaneous on making that correction. And don't let them get away with it, not once. I tell people that if you let them get away with it once, they're going to do it two more times. If you let them get them twice, they're going to try it four more times. So that's something you have to squash right away. What I normally do, well, if they put the paw up, I will tap them on the paw and tell them no, off. Um, if, you know, you, you just got to squash it. If they're jumping completely up with you, take your hand like this across the, above them and work your way down and tell them off, no, and use your finger. You have to be very distinct in making sure that they know that is unacceptable behavior. Big dogs with big feet and big toenails can leave some serious damage. And the uh, ADA laws specifically say that they have to have all four feet on the ground. 
it's one way that you're going to get in trouble with the ADA is if you have a dog that's pawing or jumping up on things or people. So that's that's a really big problem that you have to squash right away. dogs have problems with little dogs um, that's again when a dog doesn't get along with another dog you got to squash that right away you know and it could be cases like you know like uh, <coughs> Bentley and Walter I mean sometimes you just well, you couldn't put them together yeah so the, the bottom line is that don't ever put them together um, but I, I notice sometimes the, the, the larger dogs like the will mess around with the Shih Tzus you just got to start making the boundaries on that and know and stay right after it until they realize that that's not acceptable. If you have to, make them go lay down on their bed. Time out. Uh, but you got to squash that. The key thing you have to remember is who's in charge, the human or the dog? You set the rules. That's why I tell people, I don't care what rules you have. I don't allow Charlie on furniture. If you want to let your dog on furniture, that's perfectly fine. But you got to stay consistent with the rules that you have in your house. Can't be one day they can get on, one day they can't, because you're going to confuse the dog. So just make the rules, stick with them, be consistent, and enforce it. If you let your dog tell you what you're going to do, you're going to have problems. I can tell you one place I have problems. I've been feeding my dog off the plate. When I'm finished by the dinner, I feed him the scraps off the fork, you know. Yeah. Now he stands and stares at me. <laughs> and that's I know better. <laughs> and that's terrible. I hate it. Okay. <clears> There's <throat> Super Dave. I, I only got one letter here so far. Oh. Is it a bill? No, I don't well, think so. You're ahead of the game, then. You're right. Okay. It's not a bill. That's good. Got packages, but I don't have them. That goes over there someplace. That goes there. Immediate response. Uh oh. Over there. This one I gotta figure out. Chewy. Capital One, they lived here years ago. Nice at twelve. Oh, yeah. Yeah. The sports one. Yeah. Yeah. We know it's not. Here we go. That's it. We're done. Okay. Good night. Sorry, never got mailed. Hmm. Sorry it never got mailed. Goldie's sister. Something happened to it. That's the other one. That's yesterday. What the hell? Oh. Chicken break. Okay. There we go. There we go. Someday we're going to take that string off there because it just gets in the way. We can have that one. Now, Chicken Bread, right, Chicken Brick Sunday went right past me this month, so I'm sending a check for 20. Not much, but hopefully. I'll be back on track in June. It's wonderful. $10 a month is just wonderful. If everybody did that, we'd be laughing. Thanks for including our trip to um, S-E-U-S. Southeast U.S.? Mm -hmm. Okay. Have heard 
from several CPs and look forward to meeting them whenever it's possible. We'll take lots of poker chips with us when we, our four-footed ambassador, four-footed service dog project in Vansburg goes south. The harness which has the Velcro service dog on it is working well in places where I'm comfortable taking off the vest and allowing people to patter. Ava seems to understand that with the harness on, she's still there to help me, but she knows it's okay to socialize as opposed to when she has a vest on, has to be focused on me, period. Ava knows the people in my chair yoga and Thai chai classes <coughs> at Council on Aging, and they have been very respectful of her vest, helpful and understanding. Ava has become quite comfortable with them. Because we go there regularly and everybody knows she's a service dog, I have used the harness without the vest recently. Since the harness says service dog on it, I'm comfortable walking into a building without the vest. Needless to say, people in the class love being able to pat her and to talk to her. Meanwhile, Ava waits patiently for her calming weekly massage from the yoga teacher. <laughs> Spoiled rotten. Thanks again for the gift that never lets me down. Happy mud season. But I'll take mud over drought. That's right, Cindy and Ava. Okay, our one letter of the day. Well, maybe there's letters in here. Let's have a look. Let's have a look. From, I know her, Zionsville, Indiana. Mm. She's a regular. You think I'd remember their names, but I don't necessarily. <coughs> well, I remember Zionsville. Here we go. One of those. And we got some of these. I'm out of these in my car. I think I just got here another one of these. Here's another thing. There's another thing in here. Another present. Lots of presents. I think these are all. Yeah, I could, I could use those actually in my golf cart, which is right outside the door. Okay. And this is. I don't know what this is. I lost the scissors already. There we go. And here we have some some plane pickers. Oh, we have okay. The other ones are the models, the super ones, with the bag. bank. That's got to be the checkbook. Okay, tear here to open. Let me read the directions. Tear here to open. You want to tear there? Okay. There we go. We got it. You than me. <coughs> Linda? She just left. Huh? She left? Yeah. One minute after five. I don't know why. Didn't do that? Uh. It's well wrapped. <laughs> Go ahead. You want to pull it out? Did you pull it out? It's kind of sealed in there. Yeah. Wasn't easy, was it? No. <clears throat> let's see, but let's make sure we got it right number one before we go too far here. Always like to check the four four three nine. Four 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 three nine. Got it. Okay. 
Could one of you put this on the desk? No, the bank. No, this time it was my computer. Somebody took over the cursor. That was a new one on it. So I shut it off immediately and called the bank to shut down the accounts. Well, service store projects got three accounts and I have three accounts. Oh gosh. They all had to be duplicated. Are you counting? I've now got 12 accounts. Oh, God. And they all have charge cards with them, you know, or some of them do. Wow. So it really, it, I've lost all. Not that I had much sanity to begin with. I had my, uh, I was having computer issues at one point, and so I called, you know, the computer people. I was like, what's going on? And they're like, well, we can help you, blah, 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 and we'll take over. And I'm like, okay, that sounds fine. And I was doing something else, and like you're saying, all of a sudden my cursor started moving, and I realized, oh, he was up. actually doing yeah. this stuff. Yeah. So instead of me, instead yeah. of him trying to talk me through it, he was legitimate. Oh yeah, he was legitimate. It was a legitimate. Nobody yeah. was. No, yeah, it's was kind of a freaky feeling. feeling when but you it was. It was very weird. I'm like, oh, that's really strange. Yes. Oh, good. These these we are beginning to run out of. The hotel. Ah. Huh. Ah. We, yes, we are running out of that stuff. That's what I meant to tell everybody a while ago. Well, here's a couple of golf balls. Oh, I'll make those into, I'll make those into monkey fists. Okay, wonderful. And a whole bunch of pickers. Pickers. <clears throat> and closed are poo pickers. Some toiletries for the guest house. That they, that's good. Who took the bag? Yeah, it's, oh, it's up here. behind you where you put it. That's where I had trouble getting that the first seat, the, the string. <laughs> Some toiletries for the guest house and three golf balls of unknown origin found in the back of the kitchen drawer. I think you mentioned it. <laughs> Doesn't everybody? <laughs> well, that's what you use for golf balls for Cora the Blue Monkey Fish. If not, throw them out. Monkey? The money is for the fun fund as requested by two CPs who had recent losses and asked that money be sent to CP instead of cards. Amber of Colorado lost her daughter, oh dear. And Diana lost her husband. Thank you for all you do. Oh, I didn't know That's too bad. Well, I'm sorry to hear that, but I'm glad they sent money for the fun fund instead of cards. Did you, did you want this card now? Sure. You can have that. You can also have this too, these are all Beautifully done. These are these are the kind that go in the pockets. Mm -hmm. This is going to be something else again. I don't know. I don't know what this is. I don't know which way is up. Probably that way. This this has this has this is from Wanda and. It's from Wanda. Wanda. It has, it has a, it's an interesting box, she says, dear. That's a very interesting box, I think. Wanda. Very similar to some of the cards that she sends me. Okay, so this is the Texas Wanda. Yeah. Okay. Oh. Oh, okay. Weird things. Yes, sheets. This is sheets. I'm going to use that as a... Okay. There's sheets. Sheets and, and towels. towels. Nice. Except for the guest, yeah, guest house. Whatever. Here, you want to take those? Put that whole thing together because that's the matching towel. Got that? If I try to figure out what size it is, that would be a good thing to know. And we have a whole bunch of towels. It looks like they've been washed. I'm going to say they're washed. Wonderful, sort of washcloth towels and things. These can go right over there. It's very interesting. I love the box. Can you figure out what size those are? You're on the next box, too. Oh, yeah, I'm sorry. You're holding up the progress I'm here. Sorry. There you go. 
Who? It's a light. Who? It's a light, light box. It's a light box. We don't know who it's from. There's no, no Amazon fulfillment. Amazon fulfillment. Amazon fulfillment. No. This is a mystery box. Oops. Mystery box. You got any words of advice? For your mystery box? No, no. For oh, the, what's, um, what, what? I looks like Fuller Queen, but it's just it's a fitted sheet. There's no there's no oh. flashy. So. Okay, well, <clears throat> somewhere we're gonna figure it out. Okay, it's a big box. Oh, I know what that is. That's the, that's the body pillow I sent for. Ah. That's got to go in my room. <laughs> Snoogle. Yeah, I'm all for it tonight, too. Oh, that is killing me. I, I, it's a long story. Where to start? We I don't want the box, so I just, it's just yeah. I always sleep very well on a sofa. Uh-huh. Okay. And for a while, I bought a sofa in there. They said, you're crazy in a sofa instead of a bed, you know. Have a good time with something. I got shamed into buying it on bed. So I now have a bed in there. It, mind you, it's a Barker bed, the dog bed. Right. Which is pretty. It, it, it's pretty good. I don't mind it too much. But I came out here the other day and I was with the puppy. I had the best nap I've ever had on the sofa because I could lay up back against it. Oh, right. Yeah. You know, and it really, it's. At any rate, so then I went and bought one of those things. It's supposed to be an imitation sofa sort of thing. I will be happy to try tonight. I saw something. Okay. You're not supposed to walk around with puppies. No, I know. I just picked him up right there. And just... Now, see? I know. I just picked him up right there. You walked with him. Sorry. Crawl around your hands and knees and pick him up, but you're not to walk around. Okay. Especially when there's no rope to hang on to there. The rope. Okay. Please, get the rope back. I, I don't know your name. I don't know either Chris, of your names. Chris, Red, Chris, Chris, white uh, shirt. Take the, see the rope? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Get that un untangled. That's supposed to hang down so that if you are walking around in there, you have to hang on to that in case you trip. Yeah, see, that all hangs down and they play with it. I have had people almost fall and hurt the puppies Yeah. and get saved by the fact the rope is there. Mm -hmm. So that's why I've said no walking around carrying puppies. You've just got to crawl around and things. Okay. And hang on to the rope if you're on your feet. There you go, you're fine. They're all over, and sometimes they get blended in with the carpet. Especially when they're underneath the overhang. Yeah. Over yeah. Feel anyway, what are we doing now? Questions. Oh, questions. <coughs> questions. <coughs> that's my order over there. <sighs> okay, go. The trouble with questions now is everybody knows all the answers, so they answer each other. Yeah. <laughs> right? I've noticed that. <laughs> I'm just sitting here. You know? It's nine remarks now and again. Okay. Will the rest of the year and a half old dogs be matched soon? I think so. I don't think we have any wipeouts coming. Not that I know of. He is the plan for Gretchen to be a service dog? Yes. Yes. I believe so. She had her tail cropped, too. Yes, That's she did. That's probably why she's upset. Yeah. Tail is gone. Mm-hmm. Well, luckily she wags with her whole body, so. <laughs> she is a wiggle butt. Did the dog food delivery happen today? Half of it. We got the wet food. Really? We did not get the dry food. Wow. One, don't know why. Don't know Just why. Well, they, they, they ship them from two different. Oh, they, okay. they use two different trucking companies to ship them. Yep. I saw you with the tractor and loading. Well, I know. Yeah. Well, that guy wanted, he, he said he'd take back the pallets. Yep. That's a good thing, too. Oh, yeah, that is good. So we gave him two big stacks of pallets, and we'll get the. Oh, he made the money off those pallets. He could be. I don't yep. know. You can't get money for them around here, or I'd be selling them. You used to get seven bucks for them. Uh -huh. I do know people who take them and use them as firewood. Firewood? Well, I, we could use them as firewood, too. And you've said this before, too. Furniture? 
Yeah. That's right. There are yeah. people who oh, it's a big have the capacity. Yeah. Can you make out a pallet? Yep. Go ahead. Yeah. Yeah, that's some really, Nothing's really good it, hardwood. Yeah. <laughs> you just have to have the right equipment to, to plane yeah. it and smooth yeah. it. Yeah. Well, I saw one the other day. It was kind <clears> of a, a shell. The whole thing up on the wall with shells. Yep. It really was kind of interesting looking. No, there, there was... Uh, hanging off it. One of the PBS do-it-yourself shows, the guy made a, a table out of yeah. pallet yeah. wood. Yeah. That's good wood. It was a beautiful table when he was done. Was there a Laney and Walter tie? There was. 11 minutes, so now we are up two. Very good. Took him a long time to decide to do it. Oh, that's terrible with him. That poor female. My body pillow is 23 pounds, very long. How big is yours? This is a funny shape thing. Is it? I don't know. It's not heavy. No, I can not, tell you I that. I don't think it's 23 pounds. How was your day? It was interesting. What did I do? Uh, well, you got dog food. I know that. I got chain link fence. <laughs> ah. Got the chain link fence for the back of the new building. Good. And had a very interesting time putting it up. I had a bunch of high school kids helping. Yeah. They were a very big help. I, don't, I could not have done it myself. I'm sorry I couldn't have done it. But at any rate, the whole concept of putting, putting them at right angles to each other, the minute you get two hooked at right angles, they stand up all by themselves. Yeah. And then you put a third side on, and then you come up with another gate. Now you've got a corner with three. That's not as simple as people think. No. Well, because if you if you hook the gate to the gate and then you know and then the perpendicular back, you have trouble getting the nuts and bolts in the place. Oh yeah. You know, it's not impossible, but it's just yeah, difficult. It's difficult. <clears throat> With them helping, they they tipped it sideways. They got a few of them crossways into the you know it just uh. <laughs> it was interesting. I couldn't help at all. I just sat and unscrewed the nuts and bolts for everybody. So but we got it done. It's all done? Well, it, it needs to be screwed to the wall now. Yeah. Those aren't done. But it's assembled. But we have to straighten them out a little bit, too. The, the, the clamps that they gave us with these, with this, they're not the heavy ones. We bent several. Yeah. You shouldn't be able to bend those. No. And I knew I had a collection of the clamps underneath the, the shop table. So I spent the afternoon sorting them all out, pairing them up, getting a nut and a bolt, and, you know, all ready to use them. So I have a whole set. So I'm going to have to go through and just replace those flimsy things because they're just not going to hold. Mm -hmm. the, ch the fence is good. The fence is the heavy duty. You can't have light chain link fence with great tape. No, they with great tape. Those, uh, those clamps, I imagine, aren't good. And then, you know, <laughs> if anything's going to break, the things are going to break it. So uh -huh. you have to go with the heavy duty. Let's see. Dearest Carlene, reference the rope. Cannot recall who the volunteer was, but a pup tripped her. She grabbed the rope and literally spun about on it. I remember that. Not only saving the puppies, but herself in the process. Oh, I from, that. from the uh, she possible got both serious her hands injury. She on the rope and uh -huh. she fell and ended up swinging. It, it's, it's, it's saved lives, but on top of that, I'll tell you, I get annoyed when I see it swung sideways. Yeah. Because it's. <laughs> and I use it. You know? Mm hmm Definitely is a help when you're standing up, for sure. Oh! Yeah. Most of puppies around. Read that comment again about the 23-pound, very long pillow. It's the cat. Oh, read that comment. 23 pounds. That's a heavy That's a pillow. big cat. <laughs> Where was it? Huh, I don't understand that too much. My body pillow is my 23-pound, very long cat. Ah! Oh, okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Guess I read that one too quick. <laughs> it's the cat. Okay. okay. What's for dinner? It's something... Chicken and broccoli alfredo. Chicken and broccoli Alfredo. Nobody asked that. I beat them to it. <clears throat> <laughs> Do you
Do you hope for Mindy to be a breeder? I hope so. The other four, three of the litter were all boys. Yep. She's a sweetie. She's not doing very well with the basket routine. But no, I, no, no. I don't spend time with her either. I'm glad she obeys as well as she does. Does she have interest? None. No? No. She doesn't like to put things in her mouth. I th I, I'm not sure if ba Bailey wasn't that way to begin with. So it says, that was sweet volunteer Lori. Miss her. That did the, 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 the swinging. It was more than that one. I, yeah, I saw I've, somebody else. I've seen other. I've, I've grabbed him a couple of times. Yeah. It helps getting over the fences, too. Things like that. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Well, they're slow today. Very slow. Yep. Oh, here we go. Let's pick up the pace, people. Come on. I say Mindy and Watson puppies. Mindy and Watson puppies. A possible matches when they get older. To I'm not too sure about Watson. Yeah. I don't. At the moment, I don't like his rear end. The jury is still out on Watson. Yeah, and as George, you know, somebody will say, well, just try it once. No. no. We have pretty good hips in our whole line, and I don't want to breed in yep. something that's not. We have, ex you won't find this many Great Danes with this many good hips anywhere in the country, I don't think. Really, I mean, they're, they're known for hip dysplasia. Then our Great Danes got beautiful butts. Well, I mean, <laughs> yes, they do. They, they can stand, well, I watch them when they eat. They stand up in those feeders, mm -hmm. and I watch their rear ends develop, the muscling and all, and they're, they're fine. We haven't had, I, I don't think, he's, I don't think we've had He's looking at you saying, why did you do that? Huh? He, he oh. swung the rope and the puppy was playing with it. He looked up and said, why did you do that? Here we go. He's happy now. The puppies like to swing on the ropes, too. Yeah. <laughs> <clears throat> yeah, Kelly got a bunch oh, of pictures of them. Oh, really? Swinging. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, no. Super cute. Oh, no. <laughs> okay, here we go. So We're getting some more. As soon as I sneeze, it just froze. Like, oh, God. <laughs> <clears throat> I am having couscous, lamb, and broccoli. Care to join me? Yes. Couscous, mm -hmm. lamb, that would be a good thing. You have to go to Maryland to do it, though, I oh, think. Sorry so. about that. Save some. Okay. Is sizzle to be a breeder and still your service dog? Yeah, something like that. Mm -hmm. Well, what is dessert then? Huh? Huh? And dearest Carlene, did you manage to eat something gulp healthy? Supper's going to be healthy. <laughs> I did. I had, what the hell I had for breakfast? I had steak for breakfast. Steak? Steak and eggs. Oh. Yes. Grace bought some. Anyway, and then lunch I had last night's supper, so I had lima beans, corn, potatoes, and and uh, salmon. 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 That wasn't bad. Big hunk of butter on it. They kicked about right. See, now the questions are coming. Someone suggested I refresh, but I don't need to. <clears throat> Did the chicken brick letter get into the drawer? I thought so. The drawer. What did you have it over here? Oh, uh, you may have put it in the jar too. <laughs> A couple. Of them. Does this person want chicken refrigerator too? This was a fun, fun one. Put the check in the jar. I did. Okay. I'm always pretty good with the check, but it's the other.
She sent me this by email first. I, this one I don't quite understand. Sorry, uh, I never got the... I remember hearing, I think you had put it yeah. in with the doggy once when she sent it from email. Right. Yeah. Okay. Whoop! Made it. Nice catch. Nice catch. So, chicken bricks were good. How many Danes has Bentley fathered? Oh, geez. I think it's like 32, 35, somewhere 35, in there. 35, yeah. yeah. In the 30s, we anyway. We them up once. And, and a high percentage of service dogs. Okay. I'm really upset that Opal is the fat, because she had a good litter, too. Mm -hmm. But she's so fat, I just don't dare breed her. I always thought she was stocky anyway, though. She is stocky, but this is not stocky. Yeah. This is bulgy. <laughs> I think if she were pregnant on top of it, she would have real problems. If you decide not to use Watson, what will be your next step to obtain a fresh breeding line? Keep on looking around. Mm -hmm. You know, I'm pulling in Gromit. Who's Walter? Uh -huh. We have Tony. Tony, who's yeah. he's somebody still else. Out there. Yep. And Wil Wilbur seems to match quite a few. So I think we're we're due for an awful lot of black dogs. That's what the <laughs> no. problem's going to be. <laughs> no more mantles, please. <laughs> well, I don't know what I don't know what Walter's going to throw because see, he's not really a harlequin. Right. He's a flattened pound uh, or whatever they call yeah, him. Yeah, I can't remember. Um, so he may throw. Uh, who knows? Piebald. Piebald. Yeah. I don't, know, with a I don't know whether he throws pie balls, though. Yeah, we'll wait and see. Of course, his sister is a Merle, so... Yeah. That's that's in there. Oh, the Merle is not in everybody. No. If you... No, I read that. Finn seems to be a really great service dog for Eve. Who? Finn. Oh. With little Eve. Oh. I, I'd say that's a... Pretty yeah. darn good match, you know. Yes, he d and he's devoted to her too. Yes, I watched the movies of him, of her running around on a scooter and things, and he's right behind her. Uh huh. They posted some videos yesterday on Facebook, and they're playing out in the yard, and he was having the best time grabbing the branches out of the tree. Oh, it was so that. cute to watch. And it was thrilling because those hips are good. Yeah. You couldn't find. Uh, how many show dogs to grab that oh, branch yeah. like that? I don't, I don't know. He's good. <laughs> and that's why <clears throat> I'm hesitant to breed. I mean, if, I, if, I, if I'm going to breed Watson, he's going to have to have hip x-rays and all that sort of stuff. I wouldn't, from what he looks like, I wouldn't breed him. I so if we're going to try, we're going to have to go and have all sorts of x-rays first. Yep. Maybe his butt end just developed. It could, could be. He just, yeah, I've heard was Walter was kind of lanky yep, looking. Yeah, and he, he was raised in a kennel longer yep, than ours. Yeah. So he hasn't had the exercise. Oh, well, he should be getting it here. That's he should sure. be getting it here. He, he's getting it here. He, he ran right off the picnic table the other day. Right oh, no. Eat. Bang. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Very unhappy. <laughs> he doesn't watch where he puts his feet. He no, just goes. He's, he's stepped on me a few times. Oh. Boom, <laughs> He does. At least it wasn't Mo. Well, he's got thumpy <laughs> paws, too. Thump, thump, thump. Yep. He's a nice dog, personality-wise. Oh, yeah, he's a, he's a great dog. So if he's not going to be a stud dog, he'll be a, a therapy dog or something, mm -hmm. or one of our our, our demo dogs demo or dog. something. Yeah. Lainey's pups with Jasper would go well with several, several available females. Lainey's pups with Jasper. Jasper. She's not getting bread to Jasper. The gifts. The gifts that the gifts. Charity has. Nicola, Nicholas They're Paul referring to her pups. Uh, the gifts. Oh, Pete. Pete with the feet. Yeah. They seem to believe that they so would that, be. So that's a set. That, wait a minute. Which ones are her puppies? I, I Lainey and Jasper would be just the gifts. The that's gifts. all she's had, right? Yeah. Yeah. So that's Pete, yeah. Nicholas, Cole, and um, Lucy. Lucy. I don't know. I don't know. Time will tell. 
Don't forget about Reese. Yeah, Reese is on my list for next. Oh. Reese and the other R one. I forgot about Reese. They're, they're, Regina. Regina. There's a purple card on my desk that's got the bloodlines figured out. Oh, yeah. You thought that was just messy desk, right? No, see, I know that. Yeah, they can play that. Do you want it? No, you can okay. read it to everybody or tell them who I'm going to read them to. Um, that's uh, that's how I do out the bloodlines. Reese and Gromit. No, and, and you turn it over on the other side and you'll see the other one. Regina and Wilbur. There you go. Well, there goes the surprise. I know. They're, they're all black. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I couldn't get a harlequin in there because oh, it wasn't no. working. Oh. Isn't Gromit technically a harlequin? Gromit's got an awful lot of black. He's closer to a mantle, I think, than a harlequin. But he's got that like, puzzle piece on the back. Yeah, yeah, yeah the, the big guy, swatch. That, like, one ear that's he's, he's splotchy. One of, one of these platinum houses. Pieball. 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 Doesn't have the broken color. The broken color is the hard. You guys check What's the barking. Yeah. Still no barking. Mindy and Watson not happy with each other. Okay. How close are we to eating? It's done. I'm waiting on you. Oh, okay. Oh dear. Oh dear. Well, then we shall say good night. Let me say good night. Because we have okay. no more questions have anyway. No more questions. So thank you, everybody. Have a good week. And good night. And I'll make some blue, blue, blue monkey fist with these golf balls. I'll do oh, that yeah. tonight. Yep.